Welcome back. We are here with 15th of May's Godly Blessing. Now, who is a Mahavir? Now, we generally feel that Mahavir means somebody who's got a sword and got a bow and arrow and got a gun or something and somebody shooting around people and killing people around. Now, that is something which is done in a, on a war plane or during any form of physical fight. But here, Mahavir is about internal fight. That means, are you able to overcome your weaknesses, your doubts, your confusion, your comparisons? Are you able to overcome inferiority complex, low self-esteem? And if you are able to, then you are a Mahavira. So let's get into this beautiful Pradhan. God says, may you constantly be victorious and an embodiment of success by becoming a Mahavira and putting every thought into a practical form. That means thoughts become things in physical form. Be firm in whatever special thought you have. That means don't doubt it. And as soon as you have the thought, become the practical form of it. Don't be like, should I do it? Will people listen to me? Will I be nice enough, good enough? Will people appreciate or not? Am I good enough or not? Or do I have that quality or not? Will people accept what I do? And the flag of victory will then be hoisted. Otherwise, if you have so many doubts, never. You can spend 10 years doubting yourself and then after 10 years, again come into the act of firmness and getting your thoughts into action. And then look back and say, I wasted 10 years. Or you do it right now. As simple as that. So God then says, Do not think I will look into it, I will do it. To say I will do it and leave it to the future means to become weak. Do it now, right now. Take the smallest action. One step, even if it's clicking onto the keyboard of your laptop and opening a file, do it now. If you're writing a book, type it. Type the first two words. To have such weak thoughts means to be defeated by Maya. Constantly have these immortal and imperishable thoughts. Immortal and imperishable thoughts. I am a constantly victorious Mahavir. That means I am constantly victorious. Nothing can stop me. I'm always victorious. Every, every thought or by the way, there's a condition for that. If you have a thought which is going to affect somebody's life in a drastic manner, in a negative manner, then please stop yourself. Don't be a Mahavir in that. Then God says, constantly have these immortal and imperishable thoughts that I am a constantly victorious Mahavir. I will always move forward and will be constantly victorious. By having these thoughts, you will become an embodiment of success. Always feel that whenever I take a step forward, I will be victorious. There's nothing that is going to stop me because God is with me. His guidance is with me. His Srimad is with me. I'm not doing anybody's wrong and moving ahead. So I will be victorious no matter what. How about that? Yes, hurdles will come. But I will use the right virtues, right powers, which I have learned in Brahma Kumaris, and then I'll move forward. I will not use anger, greed, ego, jealousy, hatred, laziness and other things because that will put me back. So, to learn more about this beautiful Vardhan and to be it, not just listen to it, you are most welcome to visit a Brahma Kumari Center nearby you. Om Shanti with this.